Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to show you how to get 3D maps on your iPod or iPhone or iPad 6.0 and up, 6.0 version or up. So as you can see, I'm entering maps right now, I'm going to show you a preview of what it looks like, and yeah, so once you get to your maps and you have installed the tweak, yes, this is a tweak, when I press this button, you will see that it becomes 3D. The graphics are pretty cool if you go really close, but if you're far, it looks like mountains, it's pretty weird, but if you go close enough, it will turn into houses, and it will look pretty cool. As you can see, it is pretty awesome right there. And I'm going to show you how to get it. So the first thing you want to do is enter Cydia, and you want to add a new source in. So this um, jailbreak is for free. I mean, um, not this jailbreak, this tweak is for free. It's from another repo, so I'm going to show you what the repo is run an instant when my Cydia will load up because my Cydia is pretty slow because I only have an iPod 4th gen this is a really old iPod because it's only 8 gigs and yeah anyways I am running my iPod on 6.1.2 and I'm gonna show you how to go get it so this will work for 6.0 and up as I said before so what you wanna go is, what you wanna do is go to manage and go to sources want to add a new source it's going to be iGuides repo and you want to press edit and add and you want to add apt dot iGuides dot ru then you want to add the source it will verify your URL and then you want to press add anyways once you add it in you want to go back to Cydia and then you want to open up your iGuides repo once you're done you want to scroll down to the numbers section and you want to install 3d enabler so by pressing up up on top there that's there should be a installed if you haven't installed it yet and you want to install it anyways once you're done you just want to respring your device and you're practically done if you go into maps I'll just find my location right now but if you go into maps it should load up and yeah it won't take that long it will just load up and then you if you want to enable this on you want to open this page and if you're in standard you want to choose either hybrid or satellite once you choose those you just press this 3d building button and you want to scroll a bit into the like scroll a bit into the map and as you can see the graphics are pretty awesome unlike others other uh, 3d enablers things like this this runs pretty smoothly as you can see the map is loading pretty fast um, still but if you use other 3D enablers, it should be really slow. So this is the 3D enabler that I recommend you guys to use. It's fast, the graphics are awesome, and yeah. Anyways, that's about it for this video, guys. But um, actually, I'm going to talk about something else in this video. So as you guys probably know, uh, maybe some of you guys know, Evasion has, is going to be stop, it's going to stop jailbreaking. Um, the i devices for 6.1.3 and that's pretty sad but the reason to why it actually they're not going to jailbreak it is because it's going to take really long and apple is patching it's putting a lot of patches in to block the jailbreak so that's pretty sad for all you evaders like me um so what i recommend you guys to do if you don't have jailbreak your i device yet and you want to have jailbroken i device jailbreak it at 6.1.2 so you want to update it to 6.1.2 right now and you want to install the jailbreak so the jailbreak link will be in the description below if you don't know how to jailbreak it you can go check on google or youtube to check out a video on it because i haven't made a video on it but it's pretty self-explanatory so yeah you want to jailbreak it and yeah so that's pretty much it for this video as i said before it's pretty sad that they stopped jailbreaking, uh, jailbreaking it, but you could probably notice that throughout the year. Like, they, uh, when 6.0 came out, it took them like four months to jailbreak it. Compared to the older versions, they took like one month or two months. Now it's taking way longer to just jailbreak a version. So now I pull, Apple is putting a patch in a minor version, that's 6.1.3. And that will stop jailbroke, stop devices to get jailbroken. So it's pretty sad. And yeah, so that's about it for you guys. 
Um, thanks for watching this video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Also, like my Facebook page. And I'll see you later, guys. Also, sorry if I really, like, I don't know. Like, I'm just, like, really tripping on my words today. But, yeah. Anyways, guys, that's about it. I'll see you later. Bye.